It's been over a year now since WKU student Ayanna Morgan was shot and killed outside of her apartment. Since then, her family has celebrated what would have been her graduation from Western, and just last month celebrated what would have been her 23rd birthday. Well, Malcolm Jones, 22 CR 1005. Today, with both Malik and Malcolm Jones in custody, her family is one step closer to finding the answers that they've been looking for. This was Malcolm Jones' first appearance in court since he was arrested in Atlanta, and it sounded like there's still quite a bit of work to be done between him and his attorneys. Your Honor, I've, been, I've, I've just obtained approval by a separate contract from DPA to take this case as a, as a separate contract. I have I entered my appearance yesterday, and I will do so in the possession of a handgun uh, case as well. So I have not had an opportunity to meet with, with Malcolm yet, Your Honor. Malcolm Jones is due back in court for a pretrial conference on November 12th, though it's still unclear whether he'll join his brother, Malik, for his January trial date. Reporting in Bowling Green, I'm Derek Parham for WBKO News.